What's up guys, Everything Apple Pro here and Snapchat's been updated so many times. We now have iOS 10 beta. So I wanted to go ahead and release an updated version on how to hack Snapchat in the latest version, which happens to be 9.33.0.0, which was just released earlier today. So a lot of people are experiencing issues too, crashing, notifications aren't working. So with this video, I wanted to do an all-in-one video, show you how to get the latest version of the Snapchat hack, the latest version of Snapchat, and if you're on iOS 10, just show you how to get it working on an iOS 10 device. And I just wanna show you, I do have that working successfully right here. So I'm gonna go ahead and show you, I have Snapchat. It does have the hack loaded up. It is working and you can go ahead and load pictures. You can go ahead and get custom filters. You can of course save, you know, anything, stories, save people's snaps directly to you, put custom filters on your device. There's just a million things to do in here, even change the way Snapchat looks and functions in here. So in the settings, you can change the appearance. There's just a lot, but you know, basically the things people use it for is to change location, save snaps secretly, you know, keep them forever and upload from camera roll. All right, so now that I've established what I'm doing here, let me show you how to do it. And this does work on the latest 9.3.3 firmware. I just wanna show you I am running that here. If you're on iOS 10, just follow the guide. I'll have a couple pointers to you if you're on a newer iOS 10 device, but everything works, everything's supported, no crashing. Sorry for the long intro, let's get into it. All right, step one, delete the old Snapchat off of your phone, whether it's on iOS 10, iOS 9, whether it was crashing, whether you just wanna update it to the latest version, you cannot have it on your device. Go ahead and restart your iPhone and once it powers on, we need to do some downloads. So first off, obviously the main hack, PP side loader. I'll give you guys this link down below. Select clone or download and select download zip. So this will download the latest PP side loader tool that we will be using. Next up, I want you guys to download the latest version of Snapchat, iPhoneCake.com. I cannot link you to it, but this is the best website for it. They always have the latest versions of Snapchat. So you have to use a cracked version. We'll scroll down. Daily uploads is usually the best one for me or the media storage, whatever. Just download Snapchat Cracked. And of course you do need a Mac and Xcode. If you don't have Xcode downloaded, go ahead and do so in the App Store. So this is only for iOS 9 devices. If you guys want it for iOS 10, if you're not a developer, there are other areas to get it, but I'm not gonna tell you where. So you do need the updated Xcode 8 version for iOS 10. But for iOS 9, let's download this and make sure to run it. Run it before doing anything else. All right, so here is the downloaded Snapchat. You guys wanna go ahead and rename it just to app.ipa. All right, so take that and drag it into the PP side loader master folder that we just downloaded. And yes, you do want to replace the old one. So that's the latest version of Snapchat inside of here. But before we run anything else, I want you guys to go to your launch pad and we're gonna search for keychain access. So open up keychain access. So go to certificates and I would personally just delete everything in here. It makes life easier. So right click and delete seven items, delete. Okay, so now we go into the folder and we're gonna go ahead and load ppsideloader.xcode project. So if you're on an iOS 10 device, again, you do need Xcode 8. I just wanna warn you guys, but I'm gonna go ahead and select the regular one that everyone else will be using. So first off, go ahead and sign in with your Apple ID over here in the team. And we're gonna rename the bundle identifier to Snapchat plus plus, just like that. That's all it should be. Go ahead and select fix issue. Select choose. And we're gonna reset the valid uh, certificate. And if you guys get this error, make another Apple ID and sign in with it. I don't know why, but sometimes I just need to use a different one. So I will blur it out because this is uh, my personal one, but with a different Apple ID, it did work successfully. Just sometimes that's all it takes. And if you're on an iOS 9 device, so how do you know? Obviously just jump into settings, into general and about. And if you see 9.3.3 or 0.2 or 0.1, just put 9.3 in here. Now, if you're using Xcode 8 with iOS 10, just put 10.0 and that's all you need. All right, so before we do the last step, sometimes Xcode is compiling the files. So it'll be loading up here with a little blue bar or it'll be spinning. You need to let it sit. It does take about five to 10 minutes to compile everything. But once you know it's succeeded up there, we're ready to go. With our device plugged in, Snapchat uninstalled. We wanna go up here, select our current device that's plugged in. Make sure again, this is 9.3 on an iOS 9 device or 10.0 on an iOS 10 device. And go ahead and select the little play button up here. So it'll begin building this hacked Snapchat 
and it'll push it to our phones and we're pretty much almost done. So if you had an issue with crashing or notifications just not working, all it takes is restarting your device, deleting it and redoing this process and it'll work 100% of the time now. And yeah, sorry, this is long. I wanted to make sure this one was great and you know showed you guys everything because the last time i did rush it a little bit so you guys won't be able to open it off the bat you need to go into settings and general scroll down to profiles and in here you want to trust this profile it has my details in there so i'm not going to open it but after you trust it you'll be able to open it go ahead and sign in all right so go ahead and agree to anything that it's going to ask you and now as you guys can see you are using the new updated snapchat application i'll show you I am running this latest version right here, 9.33. And I do have the hack, it works great. Uh, the front-facing camera, I can send these without an issue. So there's really nothing to be afraid of here. And the worst case, you just uninstall and install Snapchat regular version, but everything is working here, guys. I mean, it's the new version. It looks really, really great, really sleek. So yeah, I mean, again, if you're on iOS 10, you should have no issues. I certainly didn't, just make sure you use Xcode 8. And uh, that's it, guys. So thanks so much for watching. I'm trying to keep you guys updated on Snapchat. They just release so many updates, it's hard. But, you know, this is the latest and greatest with, you know, everything you need to do. Hopefully, I can help you install this awesome Snapchat hack and transform your Snapchat experience. It's really great. So stay tuned for any more updates should they come in the future. But I'm very happy that this is working on all of the latest stuff right now. Thanks so much for watching, guys. Peace.